and his zero is slowed down as the spear oh, lands. His oh, zero oh. is pulling the trigger though. Fury just flashes out with the stolen one. There's the Everfrost for the moment. They secured themselves the kill. The true shot for Raj is chunking through the health bars, and it's everybody is just sent packing. Gale forces are used, but they will just flash in for the double kill. Wazor looking for the triple, unable to find it, but Mewtwo will lose his life. Woo. It's a double kill for Fury. Only Wixo stands. Singularity are clapping grand. And the kill is secured by Fiore. An absolutely stellar performance on the Zoe from Fiore in this game. The Rumble Ultimate out here, but this is going to be Soul Point already being like, like there's nice play coming out from Prospect. Wazor on the sideline flank right now. They're pulling Lucky back into the team fight, but Wazor just gets roasted alive. First pickup goes over to Trick, and they do have that Infernal Dragon ticking down. Nolte is full sure, HP. Up. The ultimate starting to pop out right now. He's looking for some extra little picks, and here comes Fury on the back line. Ult through. There's the Zonyas. Dragdar picks up a kill, and Fury's still going. Executes onto Lucky. And now Singularity have the edge in this team fight. They're going to get the Dragon. That's another kill. Nolte on the attack, and then Voxnay's forced to flash across the wall. And now Pulsum should be the target, but it will just be pushing down on the Nexus. Singularity grabbed control of that mid game. It wasn't quick. It wasn't pretty, but they end up getting the win. Nolte is just going to lay down the equalizer. Soft is low HP, and they can only do a little bit of poking as Caleb is going to prop the paranoia, trying to scare them off. Here comes Chimera. Here comes the kick. Here comes the engage. But it's you trying to kite on the sides, unable to do so. The tempted fate comes down. That's one kill. This is the second one here for Singularity. They take out two to go <laughs> wide, but it doesn't matter. They're just farming stats. They're farming damage dealt here. Oh, will kill. lose his life. The Equalizer will cook resolve on their own base. This is just tragic to watch. Here's oh, the shot blast. No. Here's the arrow. They're going for the dive. They're going for the finish up. And they're going for the end. 29 minutes on the clock. Singularity absolutely destroy resolve. They have that ability to them. This is not the one as the hook lands in. Nolte's going low already. A lot of damage coming out from Gooby, but Nolte able to flash away. Wazor in the middle of everyone. Fury hasn't joined the fight yet, as now Gooby is the target. They're getting a little bit of damage off as Fury able to take out a kill. The death charge is coming in. Gooby has to jump out. The double kill picked up by Fury. Wazor's popped away as Gooby is the only one. The denial from Singularity is there, and Outlandish has to elastic slingshot over the wall, and Dragdar slowly but surely just making his way through the tower. Tiara comes in onto the flank, hooks onto Prosper as they pose the belt forward. Tiara getting cooked, he's down. The slam is there as they find the suppress, but it's instantly finding the double up. As this could be the fight for Kova, the equalizer, not particularly great, but a great kill by Dragdar. He's found himself the triple kill, maybe looking for the resurrection, maybe looking for the quadra kill here. As that is going to be simply going down, Nolte will take it with a flame spitter and Singularity just wiping four of Kova off the map. And there is not a structure left defending them between the Nexus Towers now. Only Outlandish remains. The death timers are way too long on the carries. So they are looking for an opportunity to find a fight. The hook lands onto Touch. Fury gets a lot of poke off onto him. Touch has to launch away to safety. Ericsson slams into the middle of everyone. Looks for the face breaker. He flies his arm and now just looking at the turnaround. The moon falls here. Here comes Curve with the shielding. Ericsson's going to lose his life, however. So one for one, they fight. Prosper finds the hook and Kerberos is toasted. Wazor continues to chase the snipe from Fury. Will land onto Sharp. Chrisberg being chased and Touch trying to find the shielding, trying to find the opportunity to save the day, but it's a little bit but too little. Too. It's a little bit too late. And that is the ace over to the side of Singularity. I feel like Dusty needs a fight now because if an arrow hits, there you go. Mtest is out of the fight and another arrow into the shot. Fast Fury able to finish him up. And it's just easy picking for Singularity. Sawyer going to be able to dodge away on the belly bot, but not the hookers. Wazor continues to chase in for a little bit more. It's going to get put to sleep momentarily. If the shot blast is enough and the follow up is going to go down. Warzy by the Everfrost will pay the price. And it was it was a worrying start for Singularity, but they just held on. They sustained through the scary part of the game, and they're going to be able to take this game. It's 31 minutes on the clock, and Singularity just farming a couple of kills on the base. They land the poke at the same time. They might actually just kill. Uh... Are they just going to let Wazel die? <laughs> There we yeah, go. I think that's going to end at this point. There's the um, moonlight visual into the Gravitum, only lands onto one. Arome has to pull down the path for the moment. They get themselves the hook. Dan is melted. Dan is going down for the fourth time this game. 
And Denik has to hook towards safety. Hook back in as a kick comes out from Hattrick. They're trying to get a kill onto Wazor. Throws out the Ever Frost multiple members. And Dragar will be unleashed as he locks the Graviton onto Mikma. The Death Charge hits is onto Wazor. He's going to eat himself a lot of damage from that needlework as Arome once again puts out the head around Miss. And now Hattrick's is sliding in, trying to find the additional damage. But he is cut down as XL are being absolutely destroyed in their base. The Baron Buff minions should be able to finish this game off as they dive onto the fountain. And Singularity take the win over XL and go two points up in the standings. It's a big chunk of damage. Ericsson is on the flank. There's the depth charge. The chain of corruption comes out, but everybody gets sprint for the moment. Ericsson finds his own oh, stuff. Wazor, Wazor, can lose his life. And Grey Gap Vanguard's there. Slows everybody down. And in they launch. This is the last chance for Nordavind. As they're trying to pile in the damage. Not but enough. it's just not enough. A double kill was picked up on to Nolte. And Singularity have done it. Not more contentious. Nordavind, they come out with this incredibly mechanics check kind of draft, right? You draft Gwen, you draft Irelia and Camille on the first three. And SNG, they just say, okay, we'll answer it. They lock in the Fiora and then they yep. go on. Until Dragdar comes back. They do find the Glacial Prison onto Flay Station. That's not really enough to pull the trigger any further as they get the slot down onto Flay Station. There's the ultimate. There's the uh, turnaround as Gooby going to pop the GA from the side of Fury, but the jump in, the charm, the quickness is huge! Look at Fury! And now Dragdar can join in into the fight! He's got the resets, he needs to find a kill, double kill picked up as PlayStation locked down and Kex is the only one left standing. Have Riddle done this? Did they just ink themselves? The teleport has come out from Fury and he's in the base! They're just gonna take these towers, they're just gonna take game number one. Singularity go 1-0 -oh up. First tower's down. Second tower will it's be been. falling. The Nexus has been exposed. This could be it. They're finding the kills. The Nexus is you. So no slow Q. Can he do it? No, oh. he can't. Singular. A Singularity going to make the same mistake. The Moonfall is huge, but it's not big enough. Kicks comes in with the Cyclone. Could be still alive. The Nexus has been focused. Singularity. Can they do it? Yes, oh my God. God. Singularity are through to the next stage. But it goes quick, remember. Rux yeah. did a pretty good job to zone them. Yeah, I mean, it's gone again. Singularity are not in the pit I, time. Rux is able to zone them away. They're out of the pit. They get locked down onto Rux, though. Slows are coming in, and maybe, just maybe, Singularity nah, can find a fight. Up. But it's just so hard to engage when the Moo Cow's there. The Wazel coming in with a Proto Belt. There's the Ash Arrow. Lands onto Rux. He has the ult. He's going to pop it. Jumps onto Wazel instantly. The Slicing Maelstrom's there. They throw all of the CC down, and Rux is going to lose his life. The Vanguard comes down. Dragdar, though. Is an Absolute Look at Dragdar. Right as they are just resetting and jumping backwards and forwards. I still don't know who's winning this fight, but it looks like it's Singularity. It's confirmed to be Singularity. It's been falls to Dragdar, and Maxi's the only one left standing. Prosper going toe to toe with him, but Dragdar doing way too much damage. Singularity, fight the ace. Catch that. That's a big CD to you. Not have us. No. It doesn't right. matter. They're just going to go for someone else instead. Anyway, there's the Vanguard's Edge. Pride and Bean are actually untouched, but same for Dragdar. He's just free firing away. Rux, pretty tanky, however. Oh, Dragdar. And Dragdar eating the culling. Finally, Prosper steps forward to take it. it. And tower number one goes down. Tower number two, quick on the menu as they're trying to kill Rux. They're going to be able to pick him up. They're Dragdar on touch again. Phase. GA pop is going to go for the resurrection. Bean's trying to kill Dragdar, but the shield bow just too big. Here comes Maxi with the Moonfall. GA pop, but the Nexus goes down. But you got to watch for these shot blasts. Because if they land onto Dragdar, that's going to be game. Bean called Bean. They look to jump in onto him. He's knocked Bean. up. He's knocked up. He's CC'd. He stop watches. Dragdar remains untouched for the moment. But Pride is on a killing spree. No. He's taken down Wainzor. He's looking for the double kill. The true shot barrage comes in. He gets Buster shot underneath the tower. Prosper not going to get knocked look up. He's base. able to jump away. Dragdar continues to fire away. But the Nexus will be the focus. The Nexus will be the target. Fnatic rising. Find themselves the reverse sweep. And they qualify for the European Masters and they qualify for the finals.